DWI cases thrown out because of one word in the law. That's what a St. Charles attorney who specializes in DWI cases says is happening. The attorney says his argument is gaining traction in the courts and it could affect thousands of cases. News 4's Ray Preston is taking a closer look at the argument. He is live downtown with the Bomberito Street Fleet. Well, we're told in Missouri, police arrest about 30,000 drivers a year suspected of drunk driving. Now, during the course of that arrest, they will deal with the suspected drunk driver, and the officer will ask him or her to blow into a breathalyzer so they can get a blood alcohol content. One attorney says that reading on the breathalyzer is a vital piece of evidence for prosecutors. As police are gathering evidence, they'll ask a suspect to blow into it. Says. If you refuse to take the test, your driver license will immediately be revoked for one year. And the facts are that it's not the case that it will be immediately revoked. Michael it's Carter says actually, suspects actually blow, have get... 15 days before their license is revoked. The word he's focused on that he says makes all the difference immediately. Uh, this immediately word is kind of the crux of the argument. He says that's because if a person thinks it's immediate, it may change their thinking and they'll agree to the breathalyzer. It actually prejudices your decision making process. Drunk driving is 100% preventable. It doesn't have to happen. Becky Haley says her reaction to the argument is it's frustrating and concerning. She says it appears to be a creative tactic that defense attorneys may use as a way to serve their client. We understand that they're, that is their job, but at the same time, we want to keep our roadways safe. We asked Carter if this would be a legal loophole that violates the spirit of the law. I don't think it's any type of lawyer taking advantage of the system or anything. It's a lawyer who says, it's much too easy to lose your license in the state of Missouri and many of the other states. And so if you're going to make it that easy to lose your license, then let's do it correctly and fairly. Carter says if this is challenged and makes its way through the appellate's process to the Missouri Supreme Court, it could affect thousands of cases. Reporting live from downtown St. Louis, Ray Preston, News 4.